What's up guys? It's Drone Excursion with another diversion. And today is a very special day. I'm going to announce the winner of the current contest. So uh, yeah, I normally give away drones that are, uh, I don't know, I, I guess you'd say either used or just kind of a little older. It's like got maybe some technology in it that I don't really care for anymore, but they still work fine, right? I'm not the type of guy that uh, that likes to like, you know, there's a lot of YouTube uh, drone guys that have like a bunch of drones like on the wall behind them and stuff. Like there's seriously guys that have like, you'll see like 30 drones like plastered on the wall and it looks cool and all and I get it. Like it's kind of like maybe if they think of them as like a trophy, like some kind of way to remember their progress or whatever. When I see that though, like that's, that's, I don't want that at all. Like that's just like a waste. From what my perspective is, it's like, I want to get that stuff off my hands, give it to somebody that could put it to good use. So for me, yeah, it's, that's not my thing at all. And just practically speaking, like I don't have the room. <laughs> so, so no, no thank you on that for me. So I, I give my stuff away. I give all my old things away. I know there's people that, that want to get into this hobby and I want to share the hobby with people. So that's what I'm all about. So yeah, so, uh, so first of all, yeah, the winner of the last contest, uh, just a heads up, uh, sold out. They, uh, I already sent off that drone, so heads up if you're watching this, that's coming your way. You'll probably get it in a day or two. Uh, congrats again on that. Uh, but, uh, but yeah, so in this, this contest, this is a different deal now. So uh, like I said, normally I give away my old drones and that, that's all good and everything and people like that or whatever. But, but in this one, my buddy Dave, who goes by Cali FPV here on YouTube and on Drone Nation, um, he was like, hey man, I just built this drone. I, I don't really want it. Let's uh, give it away on your channel. All I really want is like maybe some people to sub on my channel and you know maybe on Drone Nation. I was like, all right, dude. Like if you if you want to do that, that's fine with me. Let's do it. So uh, so yeah, it's a brand new drone. It's it's like it's nicer than what I normally give away. So it's actually really really cool. And I'm happy that he was uh he was excited to do it. And so uh, let me just show you one more time what we're giving away. I'll announce the winner in just a minute here, but. Uh, this is basically, this is basically like a racing drone, okay? This is a, this is not a beginner drone at all. This is not a toy. This is something that goes probably about 100 miles an hour and just, you know, can do some damage if you, uh, if you crash into yourself. And obviously if you crash it into the ground, it's gonna pretty much break. Uh, so yeah, this is, this is the real deal, okay? So I had to be kind of specific and, and choosy as to who who I wanted to give this to, okay? That somebody, this isn't for a newbie at all. This is for somebody that already knows what they're doing, can already fly freestyle, and uh, can put this thing to use without just, you know, demolishing it on their first flight. So, so heads up on that, guys. But uh, I really, I really want to explain it a little bit. This basically has a 25 milliwatt video transmitter, which is, doesn't go very far. Um, so it is, it's, it's, it's almost identical to like what you would get like at a race. Like the guys that race these things, they're not allowed to broadcast at more than 25 milliwatts anyway. So this is like an actual racing frame. Uh, it's got, you know, like I said, it's got 25 milliwatts. It doesn't broadcast really far on the video signal. Um, so- It does go up to 200. Oh, it doesn't go up to 200, Dave says. Okay, but, okay, so my, my point is that this thing is, a, it's, it's almost spec'd out to be a race quad. This isn't even necessarily a freestyle, freestyle quad. Like, you might be able to put a GoPro on it or something, but like there's, I don't, I don't think you'll be able to find a mount for it. You know, you can get creative and you can put one on it, but this is a race frame, okay? So this needs to go to somebody that can, that can handle it is what I'm trying to say. So uh, yeah, so this thing's rad, this thing's brand new and this thing rips and I've flown it, Dave built it and he's like, hey, you know, I'll, I'll give it to you, but you have to like, you know, set it up and I did. So it flies nice, flies really good. Oh, and there's one little issue with it though and this is something that, again, that needs to go to somebody that knows what they're doing. Uh, the voltage in the in the OSD isn't reading. I don't know how or why. I tried to I tried to set it up in the OSD, but the voltage is not coming through on the OSD. But that's the only thing. That's the only thing that's not working on this thing. I don't know what the deal is with that, but I'm sure whoever gets it can fix it. Um, if somehow it's it's not working on the flight controller, there's always a workaround. You can uh, you can get a voltage readout on the on the on the FPV camera. You can get, uh, you can swap out the receiver. This receiver doesn't have, uh, doesn't have telemetry, but you can f swap out the receiver and use one that does, uh, that does telemetry to give you uh, voltage readouts on your transmitter. So there's workarounds, but uh, yeah, this thing's rad. 
this thing needs to go to a good home and that's what we're gonna do here but uh, I want to give a, a big thanks to everybody that participated in the contest uh, it was really it was really a nice way to see people come to the channel and uh, I want to welcome all you guys the newbies that are here uh, this channel is growing and it's really fun for me to uh, to watch it grow so welcome to the channel and uh, yeah so the contest was all, all we wanted you to do is be subscribed on my channel which most of you already were be subscribed on Dave's uh, YouTube channel, and uh, and many of you now are. And then also there's a, there's a new app that's called Drone Nation, and so we said, okay, well let's try to spread some word about the Drone Nation app. So we said, okay, you also have to be a co-pilot of ours, both uh, Cali FPV and myself on Drone Nation. As long as you're on all four of those, you're eligible. So and there's a lot of you did that. It's so cool, and a lot of you are, are coming to the Drone Nation app and you're seeing it and you're like, dang, this is really cool and. Yeah, so th this whole contest has been a success in my eyes. And uh, I want to just give a, give a quick shout out to the, p the people that actually did what, uh, what I was asking for in the contest. Uh, so these are, these, are not, these are not necessarily the winners. Obviously, I'm just choosing one winner. But uh, I want to just name off the people that, that did that and that, that, are, that are doing you know, everything that we need them to do and all that kind of thing. But there's uh, iPokesmot. Thanks to iPokesmot. <laughs> That's a clever name, by the way. Uh, YOLO FPV. <laughs> Dave, Yolo FPV, uh, Prop Pirate, uh, Major Rippage, FPV Patriot, uh, Dark Sagan, uh, Edwin FPV, BWAS FPV, Nerdcopter, Execute, Drone Review Man, uh, Jerry Shaw, and uh, Jeffrey Style FPV. So, uh, from what I can tell, all of you guys did exactly what we, what we were asking for, and I, I just wanted to thank you for doing that. Uh, it's really cool. So, okay, so from there, I had to narrow it down, right? I had to uh, go in and uh, verify that somebody, at least one person, was, was on all four accounts. And there was a lot of you. So, uh, so yeah, so all of you were there, and then I had to, to t kind of determine, okay, well, who, who to pick, right? So it's, it's actually not that hard. Um, some of you guys... You know, they you do the they, you do what we ask. You you get on the on the all four all four accounts, and that's that's like the bare minimum, right? You're eligible. But then some of you go a little above and beyond, and that and that is definitely appreciated. It's definitely noticed. And those are the types of things that I notice in terms of picking a winner. So uh, so all I did was I went on uh, on Cali FPV's. Uh, I went on his his Drone Nation account, and I could see that there was a couple people. That not only were on his account, obviously, but they were commenting on his channel, and I was like, "All right, cool. These guys got a couple extra points right there for doing that." And then I went on to Cali FPV's uh, YouTube channel, and I saw that some of those same guys put a couple comments on his YouTube, one of his uh, latest YouTube videos. I was like, "All right, you get a couple extra points there." <laughs> you know what I mean? And then I went on my YouTube channel and my Joe Nation account, and I saw some of the same people. Okay, a couple extra points there. A couple extra points there. And that basically, just doing that narrowed it down to basically two or three people. Uh, but two people definitely stood out and had, uh, you know, in terms of my, my ticker, how I was keeping track of things, two people stood out and got the most points, if you will. And uh, uh, those two people, I want to just uh, give a, a quick uh, shout out to Prop Pirate. Dude, that's, dude, you're, you're, you're doing the right things. I can see that you fly. Uh, thank you for getting in on the contest and commenting and everything. Uh, yeah, so uh, from what I can tell you have maybe a Phantom or a Mavic. I can see that you're getting into the hobby You're maybe fairly new at it uh, But I, I could be wrong, but I don't think you're you're uh, flying FPV drones yet I don't think you maybe know how to fly acro mode. Let me know if I'm wrong But uh, so yeah, so that's great. You're, you're, you're having fun. You're getting into it But then there's an also the other person that was uh, on the verge of uh, of all this winning stuff, too and uh, that is drone review man and he's he's in the same boat with Prop Pirate where he's going in and commenting and everything's good and all that. So I go on Drone Review Man's channel and I see he knows what he's doing. He's he's probably been flying you know Acro for maybe six or seven months. Um, he's got a couple you know Acro quads. I feel like he he uh, he he knows what he's doing. And uh, you know let's let's just name it Drone Review Man. You have a new drone to review. <laughs> You're the winner of the contest, my friend. Because, like I said, this, this drone that we're giving away is not a newbie drone. It's not something for somebody that doesn't even know how to fly, uh, you know, acro mode, for example. 
this is a, an actual like racing kind of a drone. It goes fast and it's it's it can really hurt somebody in the wrong hands. So I try to be safe about this stuff. But yeah, drone review man, you are the winner. So I need you to email me, uh, email me and give me your address. And also, like I said, you have to pay for shipping. Okay, so. Uh, uh, I, you know, after I get your address, I'll figure out how much it's going to cost to ship it to you. I'm guessing it's only going to be like 10 bucks, so no, no worries there. But, uh, but yeah, man, email me. We'll get it going. So very, very cool. Congrats to Drone Review Man. All right, so another thing, another little story, something that cool that happened. So the, about the Drone Nation app. So uh, I've been using it for a while, and I noticed kind of like a little bug about it. When we would get like a notification on our phone, if you click on the, the, the push notification, Normally it would take, you know, on, a, on any app really, it would take you straight to the part of the app or the web page that it's referring to, right? Like let's say, oh, you got a new comment on your post, right? You click on the push notification, it should take you to your post to see the comment, right? Well, that wasn't happening. It would just basically take you to your timeline page, like your main page. From there, you would have to click on the notification bell at the top right of the app which would then show you your notifications. Then you had to click on the actual same notification that you already got as a push notification that says something about, you know, your comment or whatever. And then it would take you to the actual comment, you know, what you're trying to see. So I was like, hey, that's like, that's, that's not right. You know, there's a flaw in this app. So what I did was I contacted Drode Nation. I sent them a message. I was like, hey, I don't know if you guys are aware. You probably already are, but just wanted to point this out. You know, this will help your user experience if you fix it. And uh, sure enough, somebody at Drone Nation, uh, his name is Jason, by the way, he, he hit me up and he was like, actually, I had no idea this was, this was going on. Uh, I've, I've already contacted the, you know, the developers of the app and basically uh, sc you know, s s schooled them a little bit, said, hey, like, why did you do this? And uh, so anyway, it's going to be fixed. And so he was really cool about it, though. He's like, thanks for pointing it out. You know, this is, this is great. And he wanted to uh, thank me by sending me some swag. So look what I'm wearing. Look at this. Drone, Na uh, Drone Nation app right there. Woohoo! Drone Nation shirt. And uh, yeah, I said Drone Nation app. Drone Nation shirt I got here. <laughs> and Dave, look, I, I got Dave Drone Nation hat. Yeah, brother. <laughs> yeah, so look at us. We're representing Drone Nation now. So I just wanted to thank Jason. I don't know if he's going to see this, but thank you for sending that. That's the kind of stuff that, that I don't know, I, that, that goes to show that the developers of Drone Nation are in it for the for the right reasons that they that they appreciate their their uh, feedback that they get and they're going to do amazing things right like that's the kind of things in life i feel like people just need to do like if somebody does you a favor like reward them you know like that that kind of thing goes a long way in this world and i can just tell that drone nation is going to be doing good things so i just wanted to point that out very cool guys over there and a very cool app and i think a lot of people are going to going to jump on the bandwagon with that app and on that note, yeah, I don't want to get into like uh, weird cons conspiratory things, but uh, I think I think what's going to happen with YouTube, for example, and some of these other like you know social media platforms, the more that they try to become like social justice police, and you know uh, I don't know like obviously like free speech is a big deal to us in here in America. And if YouTube and all these social platforms are going to start like cracking down on people just for saying things, even though they're not like violating uh, their terms, they just basically don't like them. They shut down their channels. If that kind of thing is happening, and also if like drone laws are going to be changing for the worse, right? Like a lot of people are concerned that that drone the drones aren't going to really be able to be flown all that freely anymore in the U.S. If those types of things are happening. It, it, it's not it's not hard to believe that one day let's say let's say some terrorist attack happens right some guy uses a drone to crash into somebody kill him or whatever right and let's say the and let's say YouTube decides oh well we need to crack down on on information on how to build a drone at home and they start shutting down channels like Joshua Bardwell's channel or any other you know popular channel on YouTube that shows you how to build a drone at home it's, this isn't this isn't like conspiratory stuff. This is likely going to happen in the future, right? So like, if YouTube wants to play that game, they're already doing this kind of stuff. By the way, with with guns, if somebody has a, a channel that's talking about guns, shows you how to like custom custom modify a gun or whatever, guns are you know it's a Second Amendment. We have the right to bear an ar bear bear arms, right? So if this same kind of mentality is going to trickle down into drones, 
it's just going to backfire. And I think a lot of people are going to turn to apps like Drone Nation and other apps that are, are more like sp specific to, you know, to what people are looking for. Drone Nation's a rad app and I think it's just gonna grow and grow and grow as some of these uh, other platforms get stupid and stupid and stupid. I don't know, that's, that's my rant for the, for the day. Let me know what you think. Um, you know, everybody, everybody used to be, yeah, it's, uh, everybody used to be on MySpace, right? Where's MySpace now? You know, everybody, everybody was on Facebook forever and now a lot of people are jumping shit from Facebook and they're already on like Instagram and stuff. So Facebook is already like on its way out. The same thing's gonna happen with YouTube. It's everything has this life cycle, right? Am I wrong? Am I wrong? You guys? No. Nope. Okay. So I, asked, I don't know. I try. To, I try to look into the future. I try to think about how things are gonna go. I, I'm happy to grow the YouTube channel, but if if YouTube's gonna start doing that kind of thing, I'm very happy to jump ship and do something else. Again, I'm not in this for the money. I'm just trying to have fun. I'm happy you guys are here with me. But like, let's just be realistic here. Like, YouTube is doing some stupid stuff. And if they're going to start shutting down channels, and eventually they will, uh, you know, regarding drones, and if they're going to start, you know, just playing that whole game, I'm over it. Like, I'll go somewhere else. No big deal. All right, guys. So, is there anything else I wanted to chat about? No, I think I'm good. Again, the winner is Drone Review Man. You're going to put this thing to good use, and I'm, I'm real happy for you. So, congrats to him, and thanks everybody for joining the channel. For doing, uh, for for checking out Drone Nation, and thanks to Drone Nation, by the way, for uh, for the new shirt and the new hat. That's so cool, and I'm happy to see how that that whole uh, app, uh, you know, progresses. All right, guys, let's call it. I'm done. I I, I did all I got to do. So I, I, yeah, we'll probably do another uh, another uh, giveaway in maybe another week or so. Oh, Between yeah. <laughs> Dave was already like, man, I should give away another one. This is so much fun. And I've, and I've still got plenty of stuff to give away. So, uh, yeah, guys, I don't want this channel just to be about giving away stuff. I mean, I understand people want something for free. Hey, that's human nature. That's fine. Like, I get it. Like, get in on the contest because we're happy to give this stuff away. But that's not what this channel is necessarily going to be all about. Like, like I was telling Dave, what's the, what's the old saying? Like, Caro's? You guys remember that, that restaurant, Caro's? It's like, come for the food, stay for the pie. <laughs> it's like it's like okay fine you came for the free shit but like stay for the actual content like we're you know I'm trying to put out some you know some good videos here you know me flying or some good information stuff so you know stay here this this channel is only gonna get better all right but uh, I'm happy you're here do what you got to do I hope you can get one of these drones all right okay guys we'll have a great weekend and we will see you on the next one anybody want to say anything keep flying <laughs> <laughs> keep talking while I'm <laughs> keep talking while I'm coughing. <laughs> All right, well I'm gonna try to get a packet before I go. Got to go back to work. Yeah, some dog walkers think in. Oh, 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 we got some dog walkers here. Okay, okay, well, let's show them what's up. We were here first, and this is our spot. You guys need to leave. Okay, bye. <laughs> Have a good weekend, guys. See ya.